you've said you believe in psychics. Yeah. Super spill. Has the sex ever been so good that you saw the future? Oh no, we'll get to that later. <laughs> All right, it's a little game I like to call Sip or Spit. So the way it works is that I'm gonna ask you a series of spicy questions. Okay. And you're going to choose whether you want to sip and not answer, <laughs> boring. Classy. Or spill and be fabulously scandal. And if you spill more than you sip, then you can turn it around on me, do that little energy thing, and then I'll have to answer some sip or spill questions of yours. Are you ready to play Sip or Spill? I am. You're a writer. Yeah. Sip or Spill, what's the raunchiest message you've ever sent on a dating app? <laughs> what a quick. You're famously blocked by Sean King on Twitter, but he hasn't blocked Logo. <laughs> so Sip or Spill, anything you want to say to him right now? Sean Jeffrey King, it's time to hang it up. I will mail you a coat rack put the hat and the hoodie and the jacket on it and give it up. It's tired. You always come in after black women, after actual activists in this community who are actually trying to help people while you try to get your coins for various surgeries or sponsorships. And I remember that shit you did with Chadwick Boseman where you sent out that email talking about, oh, this is such a sad time. Let's talk about it. And then, oh, you could also pre-order my book. And then you try to say, oh, I wasn't getting money off the book. Yeah, I know how books work, Sean. I have one called Scam Goddess. You get a minimum guarantee, and then when you sell over a certain amount, you make money on that. So you were promoting that book. I clocked you. I clocked your teeth. Tell the mountain to move. You was gonna climb seven mountains. Where the mountains at, Sean? We ain't never seen you on the peak. Hang it up. Or if at least if you're gonna scam, scam up. Stop scamming people who actually need help. We done all cussed you out, then I cussed you out from here to across the sea. You need to stop, okay? Get another griff. Maybe black Sean King, okay? Because we're tired, Taco Max. <laughs> We're sick, Martin Luther King. Oh! We've had it, Frederick Douglass. <laughs> That's enough. You said you don't think that cisgender or heterosexual men can commune with the dead. So, Sipper Spill, do you think the dead <laughs> are cis heterophobic? You said it. <laughs> no, you said it. I think they just need to start communing with the living first. <laughs> And then we could work our way up to the dead. I mean, you could even start with your own children because I live in Los Angeles and I don't know if y'all know this, but there are ads in Los Angeles mm. that are, take time to be a dad. <laughs> Why is that an ad? <laughs> Why is that on the billboard? Why is it on the bus, bitch? Why do we have to tell y'all to father your kids? What is this? I've never seen a take time to be a mom ad. Right. So just, There's no choice. So yeah, let's start. Let's start small. And I have hope for you. <laughs> start small with your own <laughs> offspring. With living, Commune with the living. And then maybe we can work our way up to the supernatural. <laughs> <laughs> Talk to your grandpappy. But... In the past, you've said that Tessa Thompson seems like she would top you real good. When did I say that? <laughs> <laughs> Sip or spill, what other stars scream A plus top to you? First of all, I'm so sorry, Tessa Thompson, <laughs> but I do believe that. I'm, I'm, standing I'm sorry that. I said it. I have to stand on gay business. Okay. Oh, who have I been really looking at that I was like, well. Oh, man. You've said you believe in psychics. Yeah. Super spill. Has the sex ever been so good that you saw the future? Yes. Ooh. <laughs> Mom, don't watch this. <laughs> One of my friends is gonna be like, bitch, cause I like low key lied to her. But um, I was shooting the pilot of Florida Girls. Oh my God. And someone that I had been like, casually going on dates with, we'd never done anything, but they take me out of many times. Mom, mm. it was classy. We just happened to be in the same place where I was shooting, we were in Long Beach shooting on that beach. And so they came to that hotel and, um, uh, we both uh, exclaimed simultaneously, and it was real, because I'm so sorry. I'm theatrical, so I, I will fake an orgasm mm. for my own pleasure. Because yeah. I'm just like, wow, look at me. I sound amazing. 
actress. And I know we shouldn't do that, that's bad, but yeah. it's fun for me. You once said, all I want is a dick that is a coat rack. Sip or spill? Did How you... deep did y'all get into my tweets? I thought I cleaned up my social media. Did you ever find a dick hard enough to hang your coat on? <laughs> yes. Ooh. <laughs> Not the spill and the sip. You've been to SeaWorld and you said you refused to sit in the splash zone. Sip or spill, is there a splash zone you'd love to sit in? <laughs> if, um, if Jeremy Allen White ever does any swim tutorials or like if he gets into diving, <laughs> you know, I would, I would be there. <laughs> <laughs> she said, yes, chef. Yes, yes and chef. <laughs> okay, let's stick it up or not. Okay. Since you so expertly spilled most of the tea, you can ask me to spill. Okay, I've been plotting. Birdman hair rub right now. <laughs> Welcome to Scam Goddess, I'm Logo. Honestly, and now we're gonna I play a little game called that. Sip or Spill. What is the most <laughs> outrageous place you have coitus in? Coitus is sex. Um, the gym. Wow. Well, wow. Well, no judgment. No judgment, but. <laughs> and no, no judgment. Sip or spill. Mm -hmm. What is the worst date you've ever been on? Mm -hmm. The absolute worst. I've never been on a bad date. That's crazy. I've never been You've on a bad date. You've never been on a bad date? No. I've had bad sexual experiences. Mmm, sip or spill. <laughs> What's your worst <laughs> sexual like, experience? I'm you in. <laughs> My worst sexual experience, probably this guy that was like, I've got to be quick. I've got to go to the airport. And boy, did he mean it. <laughs> it was like. Now, did he race off with his carry on? <laughs> I think he was lying about needing to go to the airport. I think he was probably just a fast finisher. I mean, you are very attractive. So maybe he was just trying to like secure his next time. Well, yeah, he's on so. my no-fly list. <gasps> oh! <laughs>